Welcome back to the channel. Uh, there is a question that I would like to cover today. Uh, there are comments and questions uh, revolving around this. The fact of this being a concealed carry knife, uh, it's obviously smaller than your uh, full size knife. And so the question that pops up is, is my hand too large to carry the MDV? Would it be too uncomfortable? So what I would like to do is introduce you to my little friend, Okay, so these are uh, the size of my hands. I wear a 2X Mechanics glove. I usually got to put it in water to stretch it so I can actually fit the girth on my fingers. Um, I carry this MDV as my everyday carry in shorts and pants, it doesn't matter. Um, some of the comments and questions were, you know, like, will this fit in my hand? If it fits in my hand, it'll most likely fit in your hand. Um, you see, I can fit all four of my fingers in here and I can still use the thumb to kind of roll it real nice. Um, so it fits just very nicely in your hand. And then I have the, the uh, complete control of the blade, okay? If I want to switch it up to do a push, I just stick that back there. If you got a bigger hand, it'll probably actually help you get more, uh, like a more penetration on the push. But as far as holding this, if I want to hold it as a three-fingered or as a four-fingered, that's still an option for my hand. So and I don't know too many people. I've not met too many people that have a hand that's larger or thicker than my hand and fingers. Um, but uh, this is my uh, solution. Yeah, so one of the things that we uh, talk about is if you work with karambits a lot, you start to learn that you want that loop to go between these two knuckles. Okay, you don't want to actually insert all the way to this point. And so what happens is if you are actually drawing this in the same fashion, your grip is here and then you're planting that right behind your palm, right? And so yes, uh, some of you can wrap your fingers all the way in and still do that, uh, but that really wasn't the design. The design was to have uh, just partial here, and then obviously three fingers on your um, most grabs, as that allows you to elongate uh, to work that. So this hook actually helps with the grip and manipulation, and so the idea is that if we have that type of a grab, uh, there's actually a lot of space to work in that area. Um, so obviously that's what I showed Bull. Now when he drives his three fingers into this position, um, you're not ripping that out of his hand. Uh, it's yeah. fucking locked directly in. All right, so uh, I guess that would answer the question of if your hand was uh, too large. The thing is, is that if you want to drive it all the way to this knuckle here or in between these two knuckles, then the answer would be yes. But I would then also state that you are holding uh, the knife improperly. Um, so uh, that's not exactly the design. It's either uh, in a fashion like so or three finger grip. Uh, based off of shooting and pistol work. So, um, any other comments on that? I mean, you carry this. Yes, you know? it's, it's designed for multiple grips, and so whatever your intent is, you can adjust to that grip fairly easily. Three finger, four finger, uh, if we're in a hammer grip, if we're in a ice pick grip, it's it's there for you. And you have this nice, this nice uh, ridge on the top to go ahead and put your thumb. Yeah, so we just did a meat cutting demo and obviously um, he had no problems with that. Uh, you also have the MDV folder on you. Yes. So we'll just get this one knocked out of the way too because uh, Craig just did a uh, Scallywag Live on uh, Facebook and he showed how large the razor folder is uh, in comparison to this. And so I just want everybody to know that if you are looking to... It's actually pretty close to the same inside groove. So I, I still have no uh, no problem adjusting from a three finger or a four finger grip. Yep. Remember, it's a concealed carry blade. What we're looking to do is we're looking to uh, conceal it, but also if it's in your hand, I want it to uh, be secure enough that it's gonna be very difficult for that to be ripped out of your hand, uh, even with manipulation and that type of thing. Uh, so I understand some of you like uh, combat knives and whatnot, 
but even <laughs> being as large as bull is, it's very difficult to conceal those uh, types of knives. Uh, the purpose of this is for it to be comfortable and for you to forget that it's on you until you actually need it. And so obviously his hand is larger than the actual knife. And so I guess that would answer the question. Mm -hmm.